Indiana Dunes National Park along the southern shore of Lake Michigan finds itself at the crossroads of industry and recreation. Railroads made huge contributions to the western national parks around the turn of the 19th century, only to be replaced by pavement and automobiles. Indiana Dunes first became a national park in 2019, yet rails remain. Rails serve a vital role for the steel mills and power plants, but they also carry passengers between South Bend and Chicago, creating a unique, albeit odd, national park experience. Interestingly, it wasn't the nearby industrial plants that attracted my attention. It was another symbol of industriousness, the distant Chicago skyline. It didn't matter what trail I was hiking, Dune Succession, Colesbog, or Mount Baldy, or if I was simply strolling along one of the beaches, my eyes were con constantly drawn across 30 miles of often tempestuous water to the windy city. To me, it's a not so subtle reminder why places like Indiana Dunes should be preserved, protected, and maintained, not allowed to get lost in the industrial complex's long dark shadows. And as long as these parks provide millions of visitors, especially for today's youth, with memorable moments like a friendly Quidditch match near Chelberg Farm, recreational respites will almost certainly be set aside, regardless whether they're located in the West vast, undeveloped wilderness or the industrious Lake Michigan shoreline.